I need to recall even the launch of Shenzhou 5 in October 2003, where actually for the first time China was launching its first astronaut, Mr. Uh, Yang Yi Wei, uh, to space, which I think the whole world was kind of really excited about. China became the third country to be able to send humans to space after the Soviet Union and the United States. China is one of the leading uh, countries in low Earth orbit with having their own um, infrastructure, having all the systems in place to supply this platform. Um, and now, of course, with Shenzhou 15, um, bringing the number of astronauts in the space station to six, of course, is kind of giving the signal, well, it's ready. It's kind of built. It's ready to be used. It's ready to do the science on a, a full-fledged scale. And I think the whole world is actually watching. The expectation, of course, is that it may stay on low Earth orbit for a long time, operational, do all the science which China and the Chinese people are planning and expecting uh, to implement there. And, of course, the expectation is also that it will open up to become another international platform. We are always extremely happy to welcome our Chinese colleagues and specialists and high-level representatives to present these achievements to a global audience. We look forward to hearing again from our Chinese colleagues at our upcoming International Astronaut Congress in October next year in Baku in Azerbaijan. The opportunities are, uh, are, of course, countless, I would say. I mean, all the range of science you can do in low Earth orbit, uh, important for uh, knowledge and improvement of the situation on Earth, but also science to prepare for going further, doing the next step, going to the moon, maybe to Mars. And we see already that um, international corporations are set up and international partners are going together doing joint scientific projects on the China Space Station. And this makes us very confident that this will still continue and even intensify in the coming years. And we from the International Astronautic Federation, we are really excited to monitor this. Uh, be part of it and provide the platform to inform a global community of these achievements.